Welcome back to the show. I'm the Beer Venture. I'm Carissa. And this episode, we've got a new seasonal from Bold Rock. It's the pineapple one. And when I was looking for the ABV, it's 4.2. It said that it was apple cider and pineapple juice, which is pretty cool. Uh, we'll go ahead and say, I've already had this. Uh, I'm a pineapple fan. I am a fan of Bold Rock. Yes. And it's it's good. It's good. <laughs> um, probably won't even it's zoom in on over. this. You can see it through the clear glass. Maybe mm. yellow. Yes. Okay, it's a cider. Head goes away instantly. Um, but he's still bubbly. Mm-hmm. When you smell it, you smell lots of pineapple, mm, which is very delicious. Much, very much. It's good. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's got enough of the little tingly downs mm -hmm. on your tongue. It's sweet, but it's not like candy. Yeah, right. It tastes like natural pineapple. Not like sugary pineapple juice. Yeah, it tastes like a fresh pineapple. Yes. Not, um, and you get the apple too. I do taste a little of the apple. Mm -hmm. I do. I do. Yeah. Um, it says it's gluten free. If that's a thing for you or one of your friends, that's helpful. Um, it's got all the calories and stuff like that. We don't care. We don't want to look at that. We don't care. Um, Better off not knowing. It's okay. I just, Bold Rock just does a good job. Just, mm. I love Bold Rock. Now, and Bold Rock's expanding, so you're going to be able to get it more and more on the East Coast. Unfortunately, if you're on the West Coast, I think you're going to have to get a friend to grab some of that for you. Um, I don't know, it's just a really, there's no off taste. Mm -hmm. It's not so sweet, you can't have another, you know, it's right. cider, so you're not going to get all hoppy if that's something you're against. I mean... I think if you're a cider drinker, you kind of know what you're getting yourself into. I think, so. um, I think the biggest question that is going to be on people's mind is: is it candy sweet or is it it's not. fresh fruit sweet? Yes, and it's fresh fruit sweet. Yes, um, I can see it being a wine substitute for mm -hmm. people. Absolutely. Um, if you're having a group of people and you know there's a bunch of folks that are not liquor drinkers and are not beer drinkers, beer drinkers. Cider is a great, great replacement. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm super happy with these. I like them. Uh, I love ciders. Love them. The other and thing I is, just, yeah, it's four point two. You'd never know it. Mm -mm. It just tastes like fizzy juice. I think it's great. <laughs> I think it's great. Fizzy juice. Um. Well, let us know down there in the comments what you thought about it. Mm -hmm. And uh, while you're down there, go ahead and give this a like and uh, follow me. We do this three times a week. So I'm out there drinking the beers so you know which ones you like or no, you don't want to drink that one. So here's the thing. Let's get down to it. Did you dig it? Yes. Absolutely. Would you have another? Yes. Yes. How many would you put in a pick six? Six pack. Yeah, this is six pack worthy. Um... The only reason I could say don't get this is if you hate ciders or you completely dislike the taste of pineapple. Yeah. Other than that, and then throw one in a pick six for a friend. Mm. Um, I give the one to ten pints. My rating style, what do you give it? For a cider, this is an eight for me. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. This is really, really, really good. It's a very good cider. Actually, uh... Little, little special. I'd like to put a little bit of coconut rum in one of these. Mm. Then I'd have, you know, coconut rum is usually relatively low alcohol content. Mm. So then I'd have kind of a low alcohol pink cloth soda. Sounds good. <laughs> oh. Also, we have other Bold Rock videos, so look for those too. That is true. Yeah. Maybe I'll leave a link or two. I don't know. We'll see. There you go. Well, there you have it, folks. Until your next beer adventure. Cheers. Maybe ciders. Oh. <laughs>